Hi, everybody. Welcome to Montreal, Quebec. Hallowed ground in the hockey world. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Cebulski. Ray, just moments away from puck drop here on EA Sports. You can feel the energy here. What's going through these players' minds right now? They just want to start. Enough of this sitting around and talking about the game, how important it is. Everybody can count. The series is tied. This is a big game. Time to bring it on. The official's made his way to center ice, and we are ready to get things underway. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. The Leafs will play it in their own end. Quick pass to Hyman. Puck scooped up by Sherratt. A little bumping around, but still maintains possession. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Quick feed to Brody. And now he moves it to Matthews. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Here's an odd man rush. And he takes a shot. Too many bodies in the way. The Canadians move it ahead. And now he moves it quickly to Weber. Stopped by the goaltender. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Receives the pass. Right in the slot. And that's blocked. Puck picked up by Riley. Feeds it to Marner. Sends a pass over. And the puck leaves the offensive zone. They'll be forced to tag up. Feeds it on over to Anderson. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Ties him up, and it didn't go unnoticed in the eyes of the officials here. Here's a short pass to Toffoli. Takes a shot with the stop. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. The call is hooking on the play. This is a penalty of bad positioning. You reach out to try and slow the guy down, you're going to get called almost every time. Montreal sent in their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Now you get your big boys on the ice, the guys that are supposed to score for you. They'll have a chance on their first power play. Handles it along the blue line. Denies him with the save. Anderson's gaining momentum, and he slides it quickly to Hole. It's a two-on-one. Pumps it away in his own end. The Canadians gain control of the puck against the wall. Moves it to Anderson. Takes a shot, and he makes the save. Lots of time left in this period. The game is still scoreless. The Leafs win it in the defensive zone. Gets it out of his own end. The Canadians have it against the wall. Now a quick pass to Kotkaniemi. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Denies him in front. He scores on the power play. Taking advantage of the extra man. Move the puck well and get on the board. Teams are usually more conservative killing penalties than this. They make a mistake, now they give up the man advantage break. The power play doesn't miss on the rush. Montreal's on the board here, and they've got the home crowd right into it early. Aggressively out of the gate. They didn't give the opponent any time to get settled at all. I love their start. The Leafs get a hold of the puck off the draw. On the attack along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Nylander. Montreal's got a hold of it along the wall. Manages to hang on. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Into the offensive end now. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Quick pass to Tavares. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Went for the dirty dangle, and it goes sideways. And it's a quick pass to Nylander. Pokes the puck away. Taken by Byron. Puck dumped in, and they'll get a fresh group of forwards. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. 
From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Great pass from off the right side. Excellent stick work on the play. Gains the zone on the left wing. Here he is in front. Can't connect. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. And now it's grabbed by Dermott. And a penalty coming up here as the officials all over that as they saw him slow him up. And it's going to be two minutes for hooking on the call. A lot of people debate, is this a lazy penalty, the hook? I don't know if it's lazy all the time, but it's the penalty of being out of position. Your stick's parallel to the ice. You get called all the time. The Leafs will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. Well, they've gotten themselves to within one. Now they've got a power play opportunity to try and even the score. The best power plays always work when the feet and the puck are moving at the same time. Dumps it in. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. And now he tries to get it across to Simmons. Strong defensive effort. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. And they can't connect. Tries to get it over to Thornton. Nice pass. Slides it across. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Montreal's got it across the line. And he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice. And he denied that opportunity. The official signaling for a penalty as play is called. Now you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. Face off in time, certainly not on the penalty killing unit here, down to three men. Well, they'll have a little bit of time here on that four-on-three power play. But they'll still want to make sure they get a shot early to try and move the penalty killers around. They fight for it along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Tatar. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Strong defensive effort. The Canadians gain possession along the wall. Stops him with the paddle. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, the Canadians have taken a 1-0 lead. Gets a hold of the puck. Taken by Hyman. Puck clears the zone. The Canadians scoop it up along the boards. Tatar swooping in on the attack. Look out, here's a 2 on -0. What a stop by the goaltender. He's right in position as he follows the shooter and snuffs that chance away. Montreal's capitalized on their offensive abilities here in this first period. The Leafs win the draw. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Here's a shot and makes the save. Here's a clearing attempt from their own end. That one sails to the bench, sending the coaching staff scrambling. This save's gonna look just as good in replay as it did live. The goalie follows the odd man rush, comes out aggressively to make the save. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Marner's won it off the face-off. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. The Canadians run out of time on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. Well, no go on that power play. They were able to move the puck around, and I guess at times it looked dangerous, but just nothing really going on the power play. They let that one slip through their fingers. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Setters jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Slides it diagonally to Matthews. Toronto's got the puck in the defensive end. 
Quick pass to Hyman. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Price has got it, and he'll slow things down. Anytime you've got the lead in a game, you want to make sure that you're in control of the way the pace is played, and that's a good play to jump on it. Past the halfway mark of this period, the Canadians lead it 1-0. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Turn that one aside. The Canadians will play it from the defensive zone. Takes it at center. Toronto's gained possession. Sends one up to Anderson. Smart defensive play there. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. The Canadians have had multiple scoring opportunities here in this first and could easily have a much bigger lead. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. From the right wing, he moves into the middle. A shot! Oh, it comes up with nothing on the play. Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. Pinned up along the boards. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. The Canadians get a hold of it. Offside is the call, but we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Toronto's won the draw in the neutral zone. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Quick feed to cut Kaniemi. There's the whistle stopping the play. Cole's actions pretty evident in the eyes of the officials here for tripping. I always found this a frustrating penalty to take. There's really no aggression to it. You're trying to steal the puck, but you end up clipping the guy down. Another chance here on the man advantage. At the morning skate today, they were really working on the power play quite extensively. The power play coach has to be satisfied with how they've looked tonight. Here he is in front. Stopped by the goaltender. A chance on the rebound. Denies him again. No, sir. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Scrum along the boards. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Anderson's picking up steam. Let's it go from the slot. Denied by the glove, but the puck hops along. Loses his balance on the play. Sends the pass over. Handles the puck. Stopped by the goaltender. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Toronto's got it behind the net. A little bump and grind, but still hangs on to the puck. They get it out of the defensive end. The Canadians get a hold of the puck along the boards. Anderson's got it across the line. To his teammate. Stones him in front. Sharp reaction save. The Leafs have it against the wall. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Here's a short pass to Spezza. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Battle along the boards. Moves it to Spezza. Slides the puck over. Looking to make something happen along the boards. With the blast! Nothing! Uh, tough to generate a rebound even when the puck misses the net by that much. Shot, and he comes wow. up. He scores! On the rebound, lights the lamp for the goal. Followed through to the net, he picks up this rebound, makes no mistake. Once the goalie leaves the puck in front of the net, the goalie's at your mercy, and he does not miss. Montreal's widened the gap to two late in the first. They haven't taken a step back, James. After getting the first one, they've continued the forecheck, continued to press, and now they're rewarded. Puck knocked loose in neutral zone. The Leafs work it through center. McKayev's got it along the wing. Wrist shot from the slot. Oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Tavares setting up against the wall. 
Taken along the wall by Wheel. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Sherratt. Good hit to pump him off the puck. Tavares plays it against the boards. Stones him with the blocker. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. The Canadians have it now. Puck grabbed by Weber. Byron's picking up momentum through center. The Canadians take possession here in the open ice. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And that one's blocked! Moves it quickly over to Kerfoot. Gains the zone through center. Quick pass to VC. Here he is from the slot, and that's blocked. Quick feed to Lekanen. Couldn't make that one happen. Centering pass! Great hand dive by the goaltender, poking it away. And they'll dump it in. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Battling for it along the boards. Puck scooped up by Riley. And he slides it quickly to VC. Into the attacking area from the left side. Coughs up possession of the puck. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Less than a minute to go here in the opening frame. Takes a shot, and there's the save. And now he angles it across to Petrie. Feces lugging the puck. Takes the feed, makes the save. Puck picked up by Petrie. Montreal's playing it through center. Here's a short pass to Armia. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. And that'll do it. Period number one is in the books. Montreal's practicing what they were preaching before this one. They wanted to get off to a good start. They were saying at the morning skate, they do just that, leading 2-0. To support those around us with our monthly food drive. Bring three non-perishable food items and you can receive a free team poster. Both teams heading down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. A chance for both teams to refuel. They are back on the ice, and period number two is about set to go. Here we go, middle frame now underway as the puck drops. Well, we've got over 20 minutes played thus far. Ray, how have you seen things? Anderson's likely the only reason that they're still in this game. He was fantastic in a busy first period. Loose puck battle along the boards. Good defensive effort to poke it away. And he regains control of the puck. And they can't convert to the play. Moves it to Weber. From one point man to another. Grabs the puck right in front and tries to escape the pressure. And now it's over to Hyman. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. And the puck's knocked loose. Grabs control of it at the point. And now he moves it to Brody. Here he is in close. Montreal's got the puck along the boards. Steps inside the line. Moves the puck with the stop. Anderson's done all he can. He's been terrific in goal. Now at the other end, they got to find a couple of goals. 
Montreal's been the more aggressive team offensively, and they continue to lead here in the second. The Canadians win it. Off his stick, and he comes up with a huge stop. Montreal's got a hold of it against the wall. Here's a chance. Denies him with the blocker. What a stop by Anderson. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Anderson's courage gets tested there. That slap shot is hammered, and he makes the save. Lots of time left in this period. Montreal's got some breathing room as they lead it 2-0. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. That opportunity is rejected. Toronto's got it in their own zone. And now he moves it quickly to Tavares. And he slides it quickly to Anderson. Coughs up the puck after that hit. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Here's a chance right in the slot. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Takes the feed. And now he tries to get it across to Nylander. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Passes over to Anderson. Gains the zone from the right. The Canadians have the puck now. Nice poke check. Moves it quickly over to Anderson. Toronto's on the attack. Shot comes up with the stop. Delayed penalty looming. Can't find his man. Uses the force on that hit. And the play's whistled dead. Let's get the call. Edmondson's off to the box, holding the call. Player's got a little bit of a beef here, but when you reach out with your arm, that signals for the official to keep a closer look. It's a penalty no matter how you shine it these days. Toronto's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Time for the power play to go to work. They haven't had a lot of chances tonight. Centering pass! Stops them cold! The Canadians have looked good offensively tonight, generating all sorts of opportunities. Toronto's got it in the offensive zone. Here he is on the backhand. He gets a piece of it with a stick. The setters will glide into the dot. The Leafs win the faceoff. Quick pass to Thornton. Oh, and he had the whole corner. As the goalies have gotten better and better, you have to deliver it quick. Sometimes you just miss. The Leafs have it behind the cage. Quick feed to Spezza. With possession along the wall. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. And they get the puck out of harm's way. The Leafs scoop it up along the boards. Up along the wing. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. The Canadians, he might have a step here. Tries to the crease. Denied by the goaltender. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. And it looks like hooking is going to be a call coming up here as the official's arms up in the air. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Here comes the call. Hooking's the call. This is what yep. they kind of call the lazy penalty these days, yeah, right? Yeah, it is, but, it, but really the problem is you're beat, and you panic, and you're trying to help, and the more you help, the worse it gets. Go sit down. And he certainly dug himself a hole there. Toronto's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Tavares has won the faceoff. The Canadians will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. They clear the zone from their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Here he is, wristed on net. Oh, what a save in front. Still lots of time left in the period. Montreal's got a 2-0 lead. The Canadians get a hold of the puck in their own end, trying to get it out of danger, and manages to clear the zone. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Puts it on net, denied by the blocker. Montreal's message going into this one when we talked to them at the morning skate was to get a lot of pucks on net 
They've done just that, and they lead as a result. Here's a short pass to Marner. And that one's broken up. Sherrod stick handling in his own zone. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. Moves it to Nylander. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. And the puck skips away after that move. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. The Leafs move the puck in the defensive zone. And a great job by the shorthanded unit those last few moments as the penalty expires. His reflexes on display tonight. These are the power plays that drive coaches crazy. They didn't really generate anything. They didn't force the penalty killers at all. Kind of a waste of time. Price was able to use the stick to control the puck, but that's a dangerous scoring chance. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Toronto's won the faceoff. Stopped by the goaltender. And now it's grabbed by Mete. Plays the puck up ahead. Moves it quickly over to Toffoli. Takes control of the puck. Dished on over to Hyman. Passes it to Muzzin. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Slides it over with pace to Anderson. Montreal's got a hold of the puck and tries to make a diagonal pass to Toffoli. Toronto's got the puck against the boards. What a steal in his own end. The Canadiens have done a good job with their sticks, intercepting passes, yet they haven't been able to stretch this game out. Dumps it in. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Looks to pass it to Anderson. And we've got a two-on-one. That's a solid check on the play. Now a quick pass to Kotkaniemi. Solid check to slow him down. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Picked up along the wall by Brody. Quick pass to Anderson. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. More than half the frame has been played here. The Canadians lead this one to zip. Spets has won it. Picked up along the boards by Simmons. The Canadians have it against the wall. Taken by Brody. Cut grab by Drouin. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. Maintains possession. The Canadians get a hold of the puck in their own end. Through center. From the left side, takes it at center. Here he is in close. Gives them nothing in front. I like how he was able to follow the puck. Good save in close. Toronto's got it along the wall. The Canadians get a hold of the puck along the boards. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Toronto's looking to break out. Hyman's moving it ahead. Scooped up along the wall by Lekkinen. Quick feed to Byron. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. Anderson's done nice work here on this scoring chance to turn it aside. The Canadians continue to lead in the second. They have been the busier team in the shot department, and as a result, they lead. Here's a short pass to Mete. Oh, what a stop! Grabbed along the board by Tatar. And a poke check knocks the puck away. And a great heads-up defensive play here. Knocked away. Puck battle along the boards. Deneau's taking it from his own end. Takes the pass. Looking to set up offensively. Takes a shot. Comes up with the stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Price has been working on controlling the puck after he stops it. Here he does a nice job. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Couldn't complete the play. Denies him on the slapper. The Canadians take it along the wing. Puck scooped up by Nylander. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. 
Taken along the wall by Tavares. Moves it to hole. And it's a quick pass to Nylander. Straight up the middle. Here they come. Nothing doing on that. Toronto's got the puck against the half wall. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Turns it away. Receives the pass. And now he angles it across to Tatar. Sends a pass over. Shot. Moves it quickly over to Kerfoot. The Leafs take it across the blue line. A shot. Simple glove saved by Price. Anderson's moving quickly when he makes this save. There's a lot of mustard on that thing. Here in the late goings of the period, and it's a 2-0 hockey game. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. We got a penalty coming up as he was hooked on the play. Here comes the official's decision. The Leafs don't like it, but they'll serve two in the penalty box. It doesn't take very long to get on the wrong side of the play. You're a step behind. You've got to slow that guy down. You can't catch him. Maybe you can get away with a hook. Not here. Just tried to play catch up and got burned. The Canadians once again send out their power play unit. I like what they've done on the power play previously here. And so they really want to duplicate what they've done. They have to be aware. The penalty killers will probably change approach. They have to be sharp for that. Takes it to the net. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Montreal's generated a lot of quality scoring chances, which is why they lead here late in the second. Toronto's got it, and they're on the attack. Montreal's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Moved in front! Stopped by the goaltender. But he came out and challenged a good save. Steps across the blue line. Puck picked up by Thornton. Here's a chance to set up now. Montreal's looking to break out of their own end. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Oh, slick work with the glove by Anderson. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looks like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. The centermen glide into position. The Leafs take possession off the faceoff. Riley's moving the puck through his own zone. And now it's grabbed by Armia. Pumps the puck away. Slides it to Riley. Toronto's moving it up the ice. The Canadians fire blanks on the power play. We're back to even strength here. Oh, another good penalty kill for them. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Slides the puck over to Tatar. And the goaltender gets to the bench for the extra attacker. And they come up empty-handed. And there's the whistle. Yet another penalty set to be handed out here. A little too much stick and body hooking up on this one. Hence hooking on the goal. Yeah, I, I didn't think this was a difficult call for the official to make at all. The Canadians send their man advantage unit out once more. Hey, another power play for them. They've been successful tonight. I don't think they changed the script much here. Takes the feet at the back end. Oh, how did he come up with that stop? Puck dumped in. Montreal's got a hold of it against the wall. They fight for it along the boards. The Leafs have it in the offensive end. Jocelyn for the puck, and he loses control. Here they come on the attack. Toronto's got possession while undermanned. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Anderson's tripped up and the official's hand is in the air, singling penalty. There's the stoppage of play. Let's see what the officials say. Kakaniemi's getting two for tripping. Played with fire, he got burned, Ray. Oh, he's digging around for the puck and sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down and he's got to go to the box. They'll play some four-on-four. Four. Canadians penalty number 15 is Harry Hilton. And that'll 
do it for period number two. Montreal's been excellent in their own end. They have given up absolutely nothing, and they lead a two-zip. Don't go anywhere. Third period is just around the corner. Our skills competition for tickets to one of the most exciting competitions this season. Check our website out or call us here at the stadium. Alongside Ray Ferraro between the benches, I'm James Sabalski, ready to bring you period number three. Barring extra time, the final frame of this one. Here we go. Third period is underway. Once again, I'll send it back down to my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, who is at ringside. Ray, we've got two periods played. How do you see this thing? Toronto's frustration's pretty evident. They've had all kinds of chances, but that goalie down there has been amazing. Stopped by the goaltender. Great defensive effort with the stick. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. The Leafs penalty has expired. They now go to work on the power play. Puck moved back to the neutral zone. The Leafs scoop it up along the boards. Nice pass. Rocks them. The Canadians have possession shorthanded. They move the puck out of harm's way. No one home on that play. Grabs the puck here in their own end. And a successful clearing attempt. From their own end, time winding down here on this power play. They got to get something going here. Yeah, you got to get into the zone first, James. Get it set up, start moving the puck around. But they've got to get into the zone quickly. Let's the wrister fly. Log jam in front. That's broken up. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Montreal's got it along the wall. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Quick pass to Thornton. Sends the pass over. The Canadians have it from their own end. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Taken by Petrie. Keeps hold of the puck. Picked up along the wall by Toffoli. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Pinned up along the boards. And some good footwork to kick it away. Slides it on over to Kulak. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Takes the puck at the point. Takes the feed. And now it's over to Toffoli. Cuts to the front. Whoa. Scores! And they are on a roll now, Razor. You can start to see this game's going to run away if this goal scoring doesn't slow down here. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. The Canadians are back to center ice here. They have owned this game. Unless they fall asleep, James, this thing is over. They've dominated. Nice job tying up his opponent. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Quick feed to Nylander. Bumped off the puck. And now it's grabbed by Tavares. Nice dish from the left wing. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Slides it across to Lekanen. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Dumps it in and they'll skate off for a change. Holes caught with the hook and the officials saw it. Through center along the wing. And he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice. Here he is, shot right in front. Play is stopped, and here's the official call. The Canadians have been called for hooking. As soon as he stops skating, he has to reach out with his stick. Parallel to the ice, it's going to get called most every time. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. The coaches have been on these guys to get more traffic in front of the goaltender to see if they can do it. Grips it and rips it. Too much congestion in front. And the puck clears the zone. Takes the feed. Here's a short pass to Marner. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Chaps the puck away. From behind the net. 
Moves it to Marner. From the slot, fires away. He was left in there. And the puck leaves the zone. The Leafs have it against the wall. Angles it over to Spezza. And he coughs it up with the pass. Stop that one. Matthews draws a penalty as he gets hooked. Gets to the bench for the extra attacker. Big save. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Great reflexes, another save. To the front, fires away. There's the whistle and the official set to give the call. Gallagher's gonna get two for hooking on the play. Even though he's gonna argue this, I mean, there's nothing to argue about. His stick gets across the player's midsection. It's a penalty. Toronto's got a small window with a five on three. This is going to be quick, this five on three, but if you can win the draw, you should be able to get a quick shot. Great read by the keeper to poke it away. Right in front. Oh, and he can thank his stick for that one. Somehow the shooter got... He scores! Putting a special in special team. Now the coaches have been talking about a few new wrinkles on the power play. They moved the puck nicely, and the puck is in the back of the net on the power play. play's job is to create shots and if you can create them from the most dangerous areas of the ice you're going to be successful dead center in the slot he doesn't miss the Leafs have got one back here now in the third they're really going to have to push you're going to run out of time here in the last period Toronto's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Moves it quickly over to Thornton. Whoa! Scores! Oh, that was a beauty! Again, these guys' arms are gonna get tired. Two goals in 10 seconds. Buckle up, everybody. We're not done yet. The power play cashes in. They move the puck around and get the puck right into the middle of the slot. He makes no mistake from there. Toronto's come back with a big one here in the third. Grind away, dig away. Now you got a chance. Only trailing by one goal. Off the draw, he ties up his opponent. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. And that's broken up. Tries to feed it over to Gallagher. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Throws it in. The Canadians get a hold of the puck along the boards. Moves it on over to Gallagher. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. And he can't hang on after that hit. Handles the puck. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Slides the puck over. Into the attacking end. They've got numbers. Great stop by Anderson. Scrum ensues along the boards. And that one's broken up. From the left side, they gain the zone. Referee Shillebeck's hand is in the air. We've got a penalty coming up. we got a penalty coming up here as the officials blow the play dead. A little more room out there with a little four on four. The game on almost every level has moved to a puck possession game. Really, really important four on four. Big time stop with the glove. Nine minutes, 20 seconds. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The Canadians are giving their fans something to cheer about as they lead it 3-2. Scoops up the puck off the draw. Montreal's got it in their own zone. Moves the puck along the half wall. Good defensive stop with the poke check. And now he moves it to Marner. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Quick pass to Kotkaniemi and makes the save. Battling for it along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Drouin. Centering pass. And he slides it quickly to Kulak. 
to the paint. Stopped by the goaltender. Dermott's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. Drouet's going off to the box for two minutes. Funny, coaches always tell you, get your stick on the puck. And then when you try and the guy trips up, they tell you, get your stick out of there. Kind of stop. Just a few more seconds now for this penalty-killing unit here as this four-on-three man advantage continues. Well, they've gotten themselves to within one. Now they've got a power play opportunity to try and even the score. The best power plays always work when the feet and the puck are moving at the same time. Denies him! No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Loose puck battle along the boards. The Canadians will play it in their own end. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Pokes it away in his own end. Slides it quickly to Weber. Moves the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Deneau. And a smart heads-up read to come up with the puck. Quick feed to Simmons. Sends it over. can connect. Takes the pass. Sends it down low. Big play inside the defensive zone. Big time stop there. Here's a short pass to Simmons. Oh, and another big stop. Quick work. He makes one and two saves in a row. Unbeatable. Smothered that in close chance. Pretty good shot. The goalie's able to get the blocker up on it and put it aside. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. 3-2 is where we're sitting. Tavares is quick on the draw. Here's a blast. Blocked in front. Toronto's unable to capitalize on the power play. Still trailing by a goal. Well, that's a missed opportunity, isn't it? A chance to tie. They don't cash in, and now we're back to five on five. Tried to make a move, and the puck hops away. Strong defensive effort. Petrie's got it in the offensive end. Marner's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. There's the whistle. Here's the call from the officials. He's going off for tripping, Ray. Reaching in for the puck, and he gets his stick caught in their feet. And the man advantage unit goes right back to work. I don't think their power play's been very good tonight, James, even though they have been on the board with it. It should be a lot more precise with the talent that they have. Scores! Really good effort here to continue to push along, try and find a way to crack the defense. They've done it, and this game is tied. Absolutely clutch! That is a bang-bang play right there, James. That pass is on the tape, and he doesn't stop, and he one-times it into the net. The Leafs have tied things up here in the late stages of this. It's been a fun one tonight. It's been a good ride. They've had to find a way back to get this game level. Now they've got a chance to pull it out here in the last part of the third period. Excellent stick work on the play. Picked up along the boards by Toffoli. Here's a chance right out in front, and that's picked off. Works it across to Nylander. Here's a chance. Strong defensive effort. Passes right to the front. Comes up with a big pad save to deny. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. More than half the period has expired. We got a tie game. The Canadians win the draw. Puck moved over to Anderson. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Pokes the puck away. Moves it to Toffoli. There's going to be a regret in this. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. And a penalty is coming up as the play is whistled dead here. Riley's going off for hooking. I guess at a certain point, you got to let the guy go. But he worries that he's out of position, so he tries to slow him down with a hook. Pretty cut and dry call. The Canadians once again send out their power play unit, and what a golden opportunity here. 
in a close game, this is a critical time to have a power play. You'd love to get on the board. However, they've had no success tonight, comparatively speaking. Not much happening on the power play. The Canadians move to the offensive zone and uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Battle along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Weber. Moves it quickly over to Gallagher. And that one's blocked. Yeah, good positioning, James. He gets up tight to the shooter and snuffs that one. Not exactly how the coach drew that one up. We'll get a face-off. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Montreal's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Shot deflected. Let's it fly. Denied by the goaltender. A critical draw here. Montreal's won the draw. Tees him up. Wide of the net. Most dangerous place on the ice, and he can't capitalize. Puts it in deep. Montreal's got a hold of it along the wall. Gains the zone on the left wing. Out front. Shot. Stopped by the blocker. Yeah, it's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. Late goings of this period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. And a solid job tying up his opponent. The Leafs with a huge penalty kill there. That's a big swing and a miss right there for the power play. Critical moment of the game, and they're not able to cash in. Quick pass to Anderson. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Inside the offensive zone. Stopped with ease. Puck sent over to Anderson. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. Right up the gut, here they go. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Brody's got it in the defensive end. Quick pass over to Petrie. Taken along the wall by Gallagher. Brody's got the puck in his own zone. The Leafs move it in. Almost down to the final minute here in this third. Passes it over to Tatar. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Quick pass across to Hyman. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Quick feed to Petrie. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Lekanen. Blocked in traffic. Takes a shot. Comes up with the stop. Anderson's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Toronto's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Picked up along the wall by Muzzin. Here's a short pass to Nylander. The Leafs take it along the wall. Puts it up front. Shot. And that's blocked. That pass doesn't go. Slides the puck down low. Hammers the shot. Stones him on the play. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Good defensive effort to poke it away. 11 seconds to go. Oh, what a stop by Anderson. Regulation time comes to an end. That means we've got some overtime coming up. With hot food and ice-cold beverages, now's your chance to join us at one of our many concession stands located throughout the stadium. Overtime action is just moments away. Stay with us. are back on the ice. They're set. 
as of the officials, overtime. Let's find out. The puck is dropped. Next goal wins. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. The Leafs get a hold of the puck in their own end. Find some space in the corner. Played big in the moment there. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Hyman's picking up steam. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. You'll need more than that to beat him. Oh, good body contact. Let's look at it again. I don't know if he thought he had more room than that, but he doesn't. That's a big hit right there on the body. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. The Canadians take possession off the face-off. And he rings the post! We'll get a face-off here as the puck goes out of play on that save. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. The Canadians win the draw. Takes the shot, and that carries off a stick. Trying to get back on the attack now. Moves it to Tatar. Puck grabbed by Riley. Gaining momentum up along the side. Moves it quickly over to... And we are all over with this one tonight. They've got the lead in this series now as a result of a little OT magic. Certainly puts them in a great spot here. The series go by quickly in these overtime games. While they still mean the same as a regular time game, they feel like they carry a little more weight. You a couple of these OT winners, yeah, did you? got a couple in one series. They were fun and they are awesome uh, to help your team win a series. Great playoff action tonight for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. We'll talk to you next time where the fun will continue.